What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back with another NBA 2K20 My Team video. And guys, today we do have market overview. Every Sunday we have market overview. It is time to uh, sell cards now. And uh, we're going to go over a bunch of cards on what you should sell, what you should keep for now. And uh, yeah, we're going to have a code word in the video for a chance of winning 20,000 MT. Let's get this video to around 100 likes. And we will give away 20,000 MT to a random subs who comments the code word that will be in this video. And uh, yeah, uh, shout out to all you guys who pull up to the stream. Like literally, that was awesome. I had the best stream of my life yesterday. 50 viewers at all times. 45 to 50 viewers at all times. Awesome stream. I got about 700 total views from the stream. Thank you guys for coming out. I really appreciate it. And honestly, with that, with those stream numbers, we'll probably be streaming a lot more. So stay tuned for some streams. And uh yeah, let's talk about the market. So, all right. So, we got these packs in. These are going down in a day. Um, these are going on in three days. So, that's weird. Four days, which would be a Wednesday. So, okay. Wednesday, these are gone. That's kind of that's kind of weird to think about. These are gone tomorrow. So, tomorrow we're going to have new moments. What moments cards? I don't know yet. We're going to do the predictions tomorrow. Not totally sure. So, okay. Those are gone tomorrow. Um... So yeah, Andres are gone. These are gone tomorrow. So that's interesting. If you do want to invest in some cards, I would go ahead. So now, a lot of people have been talking about this Bosch. Honestly, he's the best center in the game. There's no ins, ends, or above. Dude, he is literally the best center in the game. Let's go look at what price he's going for. Oh my god, he's still 200k. I almost got him for 217. Um, 230, no, 240, bro. So right now, if you have Chris Bosch, I would go ahead and honestly... I would say keep, but honestly, I would sell. Just because you never know what content they could drop. If they drop a crazy moments tomorrow, his price is going to drop. With anything 2K drops, like let's say 2K drops anything good, you have to realize that the market crashes no matter what, yo. I don't know why, but 2K, if anything they drop, it gets spammed. Everyone spams packs and everything crashes. So let's go over my Amethyst 20 filter. Actually, no. Let's go over Ben Simmons too because some people do have the Ben Simmons I don't know why my face cam's got a bug. So some people, I gotta go over the Ben Simmons real quick. So uh, let's go over it real quick. All right, so here are the Ben Simmons prices. Now, if you're paying this much for Ben Simmons, you literally have something wrong with your brain. He is not worth this much, okay? Yeah, he plays point guard. He's OP. But bro, he's not going to be 400k forever. Honestly, he might just because they're out of packs tomorrow. It's possible. But if you do have Ben Simmons, go ahead and sell. I'm taking your advice. All right, let's get into some Amethyst 20s quick. Amethyst 20s. All right, listen. Honestly, they're crazy, crazy crashed right now. Still, if you honestly have some, if you got some for like 9k or under, which I did. I'm selling mine right now. I would go ahead and sell them because tomorrow they're going to go down even less, bro. They're going to be even cheaper to borrow. And it's kind of scary. As like, it's really scary actually. So yeah, take my advice and go ahead and sell. They're going to be really, really cheap tomorrow. Moments drop. Kids spam the packs and they never go up. So yeah, today is your last day to sell these cards. Today is your last, last day. Would definitely recommend selling, especially Curry. Your LeBrons, your ADs, definitely them because they're up a little bit more. But Harden, Kawhi, and PG-13 are just really, really, really cheap. Um, I actually want to show you guys. I've missed yesterday. I missed a Diamond Mellow for 10 k and a George Mikey for 3 k Those are big L's. I, I missed a 500 MT Matumbo. I've missed a 500 JoJo White. And I've missed a 10 k Kobe. All yesterday and the day before. So I'm going to show you what filter I use. First off. I bought Earl Monroe Diamond just because if you don't, you're going to see him in the filter. So buy Earl Monroe Diamond for like 12K and then go to enable and literally just put your filter to like 22K. And oh my God, this filter has been so money for me. I would recommend it. The Diamond filter honestly was pretty good. I honestly like to go up to where this one card showing just in case because I feel like if there's no card showing, I feel like the filter's wrong. So I like to do this. 24k and just keep refreshing keep changing whatever you want you can change the maximum bid the minimum bid whatever you want i usually put my maximum bid to around like this it doesn't matter as long as it's over 20k and you just keep refreshing but uh yeah the snipes yesterday when packs drop try out that filter that filter is really money 
All right, so that, let's go over some cards. So a lot of people were saying Lamar Odom was the best player in the game. I literally heard that from so many people. I don't know, is he? Honestly, I'm gonna check his stats. I haven't even used him. I kind of want to use him now if he's actually that good. So let's see, Lamar Odom, he's probably gonna be around 60-ish K. And honestly, I believe he's gonna drop even more. So yeah, 70K for him. He's gonna be a lot cheaper than that. 66, all right, so. This card is 66k. His his stats are actually really good. I'm not even gonna lie. Really, really good. He's pretty much a Giannis. He's 6'10 too. Oh my goodness. This card is good. Honestly, if you do have him, he may open value because he's out of packs. But then again, there's so many diamonds out there. Like, there's so many diamonds. Diamonds lose their value really quick if you haven't realized. He's gonna drop to, I believe, like 60k by the end of the week. And then when they drop that crazy content either this week or next week, he's gonna be even cheaper. So honestly, yeah, he's a good card, but he's going to drop a lot. There's a high quantity of him, and there's a, there's a really a large amount of people pulling him. So honestly, he's going to just just go ahead and sell him. You can sell anybody you have. If you have silvers, bro, if you've been waiting, honestly, bro, there's also silvers and heat checks are really cheap right now. I know a lot of people pick them up and wait till they rise. It's not a bad idea because that actually does happen. Uh, when, market, when the market crashes, silvers and heat checks go to dust. And I would honestly try... Um, Try picking some up. It's definitely worth it. Um, let me think. We got the out this 20 filter. I said diamonds. Let's go over the diamonds, actually. I didn't even go over the diamonds. I believe you should sell most of them. If you let's see. So I forgot to press enable. Let's see. So we got 34k, 30k. As long as most diamonds are above 30k right now, which literally they pretty much all are, I would go ahead and sell. It's a good time to sell every single card in the game. It is Sunday. It is no market today. There's no content today. Probably the safest day to sell by far. Um, 34K, 25K for JoJo White. That's actually not a bad price. Junior Bridgman, 29K. Yo, it's definitely a really good day to sell. Try taking my tips, bro. Sell and honestly hop on a heat check filter or a silver filter. It's honestly been really working. The silver filter probably has made me 50k within the last couple of days. Literally, I literally just do this. Silver, I go to maximum buyout 1500, 1550, and I literally just keep refreshing. I usually like to see one card. Yeah, 1600 is too much because you see all these cards. But honestly, put it to 1550. It's been working a lot. Also, only thing is, yo, if you're sniping today, it's going to be a lot slower. There's going to be no snipes. No one's on. Everyone's watching football. Markets rising if you want to sell your cards. I'm gonna be honest. You could probably sell them later on in the day Try sell them tonight. That's my recommendations to you. If you sell them tonight, you're gonna to make a lot more MT So, uh, yeah, definitely sell tonight I'm also gonna ask you guys. Uh, what do you think about the new curry and the new Draymond? Also, by the way code word is hmm. Actually, we'll get back to that in a second. I'm gonna, I gotta think about that um, but yo, what do you guys think about this new Draymond? I think he might be one of the best power forwards in the game for like under 40-ish K? Under like, he was like 30 something K yesterday. He's obviously up. Everything is up, bro. Everything that had, was mad cheap yesterday is up. Also, bro, since that tournament was coming, I think a lot of people were buying their teams yesterday. That's also maybe why there was a market crash. Everyone was in need of buying cards, so everyone bought and with like, it was crazy, bro. And that's also why I believe everything did go up in value because everyone needed their team. So everyone bought their team for the tournament and everything kind of rose in value a little bit. So make sure to sell your cards. Market is still kind of crashed, though. Other than that, I honestly hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope you I answered most questions. But uh, if you guys do have any more questions, let me know in the DMs. And guys, um, in the comments, bro, drop Carmelo Anthony just because he made that comeback. And I love Carmelo as a Knicks fan. Um, but yeah, make sure to check Carmelo Anthony. We are pretty much done with the video. So make sure to sell cards today. Get ready for moments tomorrow. Get ready to snipe. Honestly, I'm thinking about streaming the moments. I'm honestly really in need. I want to stream. I really do want to stream. If you guys want to pull up to the stream tomorrow, I'll probably be uh, streaming around right after I post my video. Once those moments drops, I'll probably stream it and I'll make, I'll make a record. I'll record a video. And then after my video is recorded, I'll probably hop on the stream. But yeah, guys, that's really all I got today. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for more. That's it, guys. Peace.